In this video, we will learn how to create links and buttons in Kutubi Author. Now, if you go to the link tool directly in the toolbox and click on it, it will give you a message, message that you first need to highlight the text that you want to link. So click on OK and we will highlight any word or any group of words that we want to link. And then we'll go back to the link tool, click on it, and it will give us the link dialog box. Now there are three different types of links that you can add in Kutubi Author. The first mo most straightforward type is an external link, and that is linking to an external website. So we can click here, we can type uh, kutubi.com and uh, create. And so this is a normal link, a very uh, basic type of link. Once the user clicks on it, it will open uh, a browser with uh, kutubi.com. Now it depends if he's if he has the his ebook open in a, in a mobile app, then it will open an in-app browser. So he will s he will stay inside the app, but be viewing the content of the of the link that he d he wants to go to. Now to remove the link, you can uh, double click on it and click on unlink. So this removes the link. Now we're going to do the same to see the other types. And go to book location. This is the second type of link. Now this is, uh, you can also call this an internal link. So it links to a place inside the book. You can link to a different chapter or a different sub-chapter. So from the, from the left here you can see a list of all the chapters that exist in your book. In the case that you have subchapters, it will also list the subchapters here. So we can go to features and the target will ask you where you want to jump to in this chapter. The default is the begin beginning of the chapter. If you click, you won't see anything else. And this is where anchors come in. So I'm going to click on cancel. I'm going to go to export formats. Okay, so um, I'm going to just type s some random text. And I'm going to click on the anchor tool. So we're going to call it um, my first anchor. Click on OK. Now we're going to link it back like we did and click on link to book location export formats and now you can see we have the anchor here as a as an option the third type of link is a pop-up message now this is not going to redirect the user to a chapter or to an external website but rather is going to show a pop-up message now this is very useful for uh, references footnotes it's just showing the user some simple uh, text or simple information by clicking on a word showing a definition and so on so uh, I'm just going to type in a very quick message click on preview to see it in action click on it and uh, this is how it, uh, it appears okay so it's very simple but very effective now this is all in the case of ref reflowable layout chapters. Now if you create a fixed layout and uh, say we import an image okay so we have this image now if you if you recall in the very beginning when you clicked on a link tool, and gave us this error message that you must first highlight the text that you want to link. That's not the case in the fixed layout chapter. It does not show this error. Why? Because in fixed layouts you can actually uh, create buttons, overlay buttons, and move them around over any part of your chapter. Now if you, if you remember when we discussed reflowable layouts versus fixed layouts, we said that in fixed layouts you can have elements stacked on top of each other or overlapping each other and that's how we can achieve this button behavior in this uh, type of chapter so it's a basic link 
it's applied to a box that can be invisible or opaque as you wish and it will achieve the same behavior as a normal text link so let's see an example for as a for a pop-up message for example you can choose the button color from here and you can set some transparency to it so that it shows whatever is underneath I'm going to choose a transparency of uh, 10 and create so that's the button you can see you can drag it around anywhere I'm going to just resize it to fit the elephant preview click on it and that's how it works